Alrighty, it's Honest Gas back here again. After a little bit of uploading and deleting, I managed to get uh, 28 minutes in my video, so let's try and keep it that way. So that was the Pegasus right there, and I wanted to get through this building here. I haven't walked further than, uh, I haven't watched very, walked very far since I stopped the video, but it did take like almost a half hour to uh, upload, so let's see here. Oh, these are pretty cool. I don't know what these are all about. I can't really see it. Pretty cool. It's another thing. Interesting. I wonder what he was trying to get at. Looks like there's something else over here. Hmm. Uh, V-bikes there. Shout out to V-bikes. <laughs> so it looks like we've got some kind of corkscrew over there. Wow. Let's see what this is. Wow, that's impossible. It's hard to read. Maybe the video will get it. I don't know. It's such a glare. That's such a glare there. Can't really read that, guys, but let's go take a look at this corkscrew. Looks like there's a lot of benches, too. Oh, wow. Interesting. Hmm. Look at all these benches, too. They seem to be fixed to the ground. Good little bird. A little teenager. That's so young. I guess this is uh, either a, just, it's, I guess it's just a park. All right, so let's take a look at that building there. Oh, wow. Record. Oh, and it looks pretty cool on that side. Let's, uh, let's actually walk that way. And that way we'll get a kind of, uh, and that way we'll get a kind of, um, Looks like we got some kind of security guard there. Hey there. Le Lubin Plaza is what that's called. I guess I'll, we'll see it in just a second. Look at all those porta potties. United Site Services 1 800 toilets. So we're in Lubin Plaza. Oh. So there's something here. Lubin Plaza is a gift to the city of Dallas by A. H. Bello Corporation on the occasion of the Sentinel of the Dallas Morning News, which is actually pretty close by, if I understand correctly. The plaza is dedicated to the news long time the news longtime employees and named in honor of John F. Lubin in his and his son Joseph A. Lubin. Together, the Lubbins completed 100 years of combined services as directors of the A.H. Bellow Corporation and senior executives of uh, Dallas Morning News, October 1985, October 1st, 1985. I think that's all it says, other than that placard that I couldn't really read. Let's see. All right, we're actually about to see Dallas Morning News. Maybe you can see it there. Uh, that's a little, I guess my camera's still pretty blurry. Get my headphones down. Headphones, let me get my uh, goggles down. So that's, uh, let's let this guy pass. So that's WFAA News there, News Tower. Hey there, doing all right today? Oh, I'm always having a great day. Ooh, what's that back there? Looks pretty cool. But well, we're actually gonna go this way, guys. You're gonna see the Dallas Reun or the uh, Reunion Tower there. Have a good day. Oh, it's so bright. Maybe I'll come back here. Look at that building, though, guys. Those look like little sheets of copper. Sheets of copper there. We're just waiting for the crosswalk. It looks like there's something down there. Something pretty cool. But uh, I don't really kind of don't see very much in the way of interesting the way we can go. So let's go now. Let's start walking. 
It also looks like there's a, some kind of arch over there. Maybe that's a, a bridge or something. Look at this. It's pretty. Sounds like a vent or something close by. Ooh. Oh, look at this. Some kind of a wind over there, too. That's pretty cool. Looks like a diner. Some kind of restaurant there. It's our public works. Now. Uh, it was actually practical engineering, by the way, guys. Practical engineering is the uh, uh, channel I was talking about. When, if you want to learn anything about uh, how structures are made or or how the uh, um, how the uh, uh, how what goes on behind the uh, behind the scenes there. I guess it's good to go, but it doesn't say I'm good to go. So I'm gonna. You like my cigarette, yeah? <laughs> I think I see a fountain over there. It's really hard to focus. Uh, there. All right. Uh, I guess, yep, here we go. It looks like we can go this way. Oh, here's the front of that building. Oh, and there's the... The uh, Bank of America Tower. So it's called 400 Record, or 400 is the name of the, or sorry, the street number, uh, building number, whatever you call it, <laughs> address. But it says Record, so it must be Record Tower or something. Let's take a look at this awesome fountain here. I'm gonna switch hands. My other hand's getting kind of tired. Oh wow! So there we go. There's a bit of trash there. I don't think I can reach it, but that's pretty cool. I bet that water is pretty warm. Got the sun beating down. It's something like 75 degrees out today. So uh, I'm actually not wearing my hoodie, even though it looks really cool. I, uh, um, I don't want to die of heat stroke. Sorry, I just want to make sure I don't push any buttons. And it looks like behind here, I'll just switch it. Looks like behind here we've got some kind of really cool building. This is called Ferris Plaza, what we just came from. Oh, wow. I wonder what building this is. It looks official. You can hear the train. I think that's TRE you're hearing there. Just kind of go through the shade. A little warm. Look at that beautiful tree. Oh, yeah. Such a beautiful tree. So pretty. Doing some construction on this building. It's uh, cross when it's good to go. I'm trying to use my left hand because my uh, or, uh, my right hand is my left hand is tired, but my left hand doesn't seem to be as coordinated, or whatever you want to call it, or the way around. Not good to go just yet. It's a little glary, but hey, look at that, there's the flag. And there's the reunion tower. Almost good to go. We'll just let this person turn first. There we go. Looks like they got something over there, too. Oh, it looks like a playground, I guess. Oh, there's a building over there. Oh. Looks like uh, that must be that court building that we saw earlier, or that I saw earlier. Let's, uh... Huh. I guess I forgot to follow that guy's directions for the assassination spot. Let's see if we can't, real quick, we'll get a picture, or a good picture. Hopefully the sun won't be too bad. Picture of the uh, reunion tower and this really amazing hotel. Huh. Union Station is where we are. Wow, look at that. Oh, it's really hard to see because the sun's right behind it. 
Maybe we can get in its shadow. Get in its shadow. I see a shadow there. Oh, he can't even see it anyway because it's so bright behind it. Oh man, well, that's okay. We kind of saw it a little bit. Maybe I'll get it some other time and we'll go better with an angle. But uh, that's the that's that hotel. Really big, really pretty. Let's go over here. Actually, let's take a look at the time. Ten minutes in. Let's go take a look at that court building. I'm gonna try and make sure the sun isn't in their face in the camera. Let's see if I can't uh, light my cigarette if I was in. Oh, sorry, man. Fade. I guess that wasn't really a crosswalk, but that's okay. Oh. All right. Hopefully that video will load uh, while we're doing this video. We all have to stop by uh, something to eat and do some more uploading. Oh, I wonder if that was the arch I saw. Maybe it wasn't. Huh. We'll have to go that way again sometime. Right now, we only have about 10 minutes until the video ends, so I'm gonna do this one. All right, now we can take a look. Oh, wow. Let me focus a little bit. Focus. Let's get behind the shadow and take a still. Wow. You see the Wells Fargo Bank in the background there. So, all right, let's take a look at what this building has been made out of. So I guess, there we go. Wow, and look at that lamp. Wow. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. We'll find out here pretty soon. But I thought it was a church, but apparently it's a courthouse or a court building of some kind. And uh, if it is a court something, then I have some pretty serious quarrels about how pretty this building is. It looks like there's another official building behind it. There's the Bank of America Tower there. But let's see if we can't cross here pretty soon. Now we can cross. Oh, and there's the building in the background. Wow. This actually might be where those bells were told. More shout out to Dart. I think uh, uh, they may have shut down for uh, not technical reasons, but um, oh. oh gosh, not for technical reasons, but uh, emergency. I think I saw some lights. Oh, here we go. Old Red Museum. Old Red Museum there. Uh, of Dallas County History and Culture. Looks like you can get some tickets. Doesn't look like there's a sidewalk that way. So let's have a head back to this way. That looks like a memorial of some kind. We'll get that too. I'm gonna check how much time we got. Hey there. Hi. You guys having a good day? The Red Museum. Oh, hang on, they're taking a picture. Go ahead. All right, thank you so much. 
<laughs> yeah, trying to stay out. So there's another one, the ticket office. Wow, look at that architecture too. Oh, so beautiful. So I guess this isn't a, a museum. Maybe it is still a, a museum of a, uh, of a court building. But still, it is absolutely gorgeous. And look how thick those stones are. Boom. Dallas County Criminal Court. So here's the court building here. Uh, Tourist Information Center, Old Red Court, Old Red Courthouse. Okay, so there we have that now. So they kind of did some repair work. So that's a nice, modest building. So they didn't spend too much money. It does look pretty, but it's not overly so. And there's that another building there. That one's also very beautiful. Just kind of going up this way a little bit. It looks like that might be the same kind of architecture over here, but let's check it out. Looks like we got a track runner there. Oh, wow. Take a look there. Oh, the clock tower. Oh, I would love to live in a house that big. That's a big house. All right, so let's continue on this way. Point it at me. Hey there. It looks to be a memorial of some kind over there. Let's go check it out. Got my light is digging in and hit me. Can I see the, uh, the Union Tower again? Oh, here's the sign. It looks like the place is pretty big. I think as soon as I do the end of this video, I'm going to find a place to eat and then maybe uh, uh, do some more videos if I've got the time. Looks like we're good to go now. Alright, so let's check this out. Let's see. It looks like we've got a tour going on on those segways. Let's come through here. Hey guys. Are you picking up garbage? How much garbage? Are you guys uh? Soda? Are you guys volunteering to pick up trash? Is it? Hey, are you uh? Are you? Are you guys volunteering to pick up trash? Is that what's going on? You guys are gardening. Oh, you guys are gardening. Oh, thank you so much. I I know it's really hard work and it's hot out today. Yeah, yeah. Take it easy. I thought they were uh, doing. Yeah, for sure. Segways. So you could actually get a tour. I won't get their faces, but you could actually get a tour of Dallas on a Segway if you wanted. Yeah. Yeah, there's lots of rules, huh? Yeah, you don't want to hurt yourselves, that's for sure. And you guys, uh, I won't show, but they're also wearing helmets. That's always important. George Bannerman. Delane. Delay. Delay. Huh. Huh. 1859 to 1946. If you can see, that's that's not exactly a very flattering picture, but let's see if we can't. Uh, uh, I can't really see the guy with the sun in the background, but let's take a look at some of the stuff that they've got to offer here. We've got some. Uh, I think they're called. Um, oh man, I should know the two-dimensional reliefs. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Journalism, history. Philanthropy and civic is what that says. We've got some really cool fountains here. Ooh, that's pretty. I wonder if they light up at night. That's pretty cool. Okay, sir. Looks like they got another side over there. It looks like a placard. Let's check out what's over here. Let's see. We've got about eight minutes. I wonder. Let's just head this way. It doesn't look like there's anything uh, over there. It does look like there is something over there. There's another view of the, the Union Tower. All right. Oh, citizens of all stations, creeds com comprising the uh, GB Delay, well, however you say that, Memorial Association of Dallas erect this monument to commemorate the service and preserve the example of a great good and useful life uh, consecrated in faith, 
dedicated in purpose to the glory of God and the battle, the betterment of mankind. Truth was its light, wisdom its guide, history its counselor, journalism its fruitful providence, sympathy broad as human need uh, uh, was inspiration, philanthropy founded in all embracing brotherly love. Its highest aim. Huh. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, it's just so strange that you know, the religion, they just integrate themselves into everything, don't they? You know, they talk about all races and creeds, but they mention God as one of their things that, that motivates them. And it's just like, come on, guys. That's not fair. There's all kinds of things. Oh, here we go. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, sorry. I'll just point it at me. Wow, there's actually a lot of these uh, Segway tours. That's pretty cool. Gotta, gotta adjust my belt again. I was digging in my hip. Here's another one. I won't read it because we don't have a lot of time left. Here we go, another. Ooh, a map. I love maps. And there's the. Ooh, an obelisk. Oh. I love obelisks. You know, obelisk I thought was actually a symbol of, uh, uh, you know, something like reaching to God and uh, uh, that sort of sense, but it actually turns out to be just a, uh, uh, a uh, memorial marker. Sorry guys, I'm gonna get out of your way. That's so cool. We've got a lot of photographers too out here. I was just trying to stay out of that picture there. So there's the arches. There's the arches I saw earlier, so it must be a bridge over there. Man, this camera sucks. There's another arch, another bridge. I know that one over there is a bridge. Ah. Hey guys. Dallas County Administration Building, let's check that out. Dallas County administration building. That's what that is. Uh, Elm Palace Place. Elm Place. Oh, it's good to go. Let's see here. We've got some parking. Oh, gosh. It's like uh, a go here. It says, formerly the Texas School Book Depository Bridge. Sorry, I'm going to take a picture of this. Uh, formerly the Texas School Book Depository Building, this site was originally owned by John Neatley Bryan, the founder of Dallas. Interesting. You could probably just read that on your own time if you need to. I am running out of time, so I think I'll skip it. Museum store there. Not really much in the way to see, guys. It's uh, uh, kind of boring buildings and stuff, so I'll just point it at me. Let's see here. Here, okay, so let's see where we are. Uh, oh, look at that it's a cool crane in the background. There's a cool crane in there. So much lives go into a building, buildings. So many lives, I should say. I was kind of hoping to see a church. I don't see one anywhere near. Always make sure that you're not gonna get hit by a train, guys. That's so cool. All right. Dallas Holocaust Museum. I didn't know there was a Dallas Holocaust. <laughs> it says here, for education and tolerance. Okay, I don't know what that means. Education is a strong and dangerous word. Education is the foundation for indoctrination. Say that three times fast, <laughs> or three times fast. <laughs> They got a little a police, a police uh, uh, camera up there. 
and some more. That looks like luxury apartments. Looks like we're actually pretty close to where we've been now. Where is, uh, where is uh, Wells Fargo Bank? It looks like it might be behind us. That was the American, uh, sorry, the uh, Bank of America building. Oh, shit. Okay. Maybe we'll go this way. So I'm gonna try and stop at that subway that I was at last. Okay. Look up. Such a beautiful building. That is actually the tallest one in Dallas. Who knows how long that's gonna be for. They're always sprouting up new buildings around here and somehow Dallas managed to uh, kind of uh, uh, miss the uh, uh, collapse that we went through. I don't think that they went unaffected, but they were definitely a little better prepared to uh, recover from it. Hey guys. What, you wanna work out there? No way. Is that, is that Spaghetti Warehouse? Huh. Let me tell you, go to Spaghetti Warehouse, guys. They have amazing lasagna and an awesome scenery to uh, look at while you're eating. I used to work for them, but uh, apparently I'm not a very good waiter. <laughs> That's at least what I was told, which is fine. I'm not a big fan of waiting anyway. I don't like the idea of waiting on someone, and nor do I uh, view very fondly or very highly of people who do like to be waited on. Also, we're pretty far from the uh, Wells Fargo Bank. Maybe. So there's Spaghetti Warehouse. I didn't know that it was actually here. So I'm gonna go through the crosswalk here. Maybe I'll see here. Uh, let's get through this. Oh, maybe I should check the time here. All right, so that's actually the end of the video, guys. I will uh, be back again soon so I can, hey. And uh, so once I upload another video, I'll, I'll leave it and maybe I'll get started again. All right, see, catch you next time.